What's happening, Anoka? I'm Andrew. Hello, I'm Carly filling in for Evan. Welcome to TV7 News. It's never too early to talk about joining the speech team. This year, Coach and Senior Coach Jogerson are co-head coaches and are looking for new members to join the team. If you're interested, they are holding virtual meetings every Monday at 1 p.m. You can email them if interested or join their mind at AHS Voices. DECA is selling homecoming masks and pumpkin bowl masks through a web store. Masks come with your graduation year and corresponding color. The link for the web store is below and you have until October 15th to get your order in. Attention seniors, need some help figuring out your college and career options? Miss Newey is available to assist and is excited to work with you. Reach out via email or through the Career Center website to set up a meeting through Google Meets or in person. DECA would also like to congratulate their officers for this year, and they are as follows. President Hannah Woody, Vice Presidents Kayla Booth and Belle Blauert, Secretaries Alex Judge and Caitlin Sanders, and Treasurers Yane Ganda and Alex Arndt. Historians Bailey Jenis and Kylie Kunzman, Social Media Marketing Coordinators Abby Schur and Liz Blyce. While it may not be Tornadoes Huskies, the feud that runs between the English and Social Studies departments runs pretty deep. Come on, Kurtz. Get off the top here. Some of us have work to do. I mean, the word choice that the guy has is just oh, yes. incredible. Hey, guys. How's it going? Just find another poem for your kids to not read. Oh, yeah. I'm sure it's real hard to try to figure out what episode of Law and Order to show your kids. Oh, hello, Mama. How are you doing? Hey, what? Hey, what's up, man? We should catch up soon. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. We have so much to share. Absolutely, right. man. We'll see you. All right, good seeing you, man. Can't stand that guy. There are times with them where you really have to watch your back. It can get pretty ugly. Seniors are reminded that during the month of October, College Knowledge Month, Minnesota, state colleges are waiving their application fees. This includes two, both two and four year colleges. Take advantage of this opportunity and apply today. Contact Career and College Specialist Ms. Neary if you have any questions. Math League will be from 2.30 to 3.30 Mondays and Wednesdays starting at Monday, October 12th. All meetings will be done virtually. You need to contact Ms. Sockman or ask any math teacher for information on how to join. Seniors interested in a career in business are invited to apply for the Ann Tal Scholarship sponsored by the Anoka Area Chamber of Commerce. Paper copies can be picked up in the counseling office. Eligible students must have a 2.5 GPA and be pursuing a career in business related field. The deadline for the scholarship is January 15th. Tornado Pals is a group designed for people with and without disabilities to join together at school to socialize and make new friendships. Join us for virtual meetings every Monday at 1 p.m. unless noted otherwise. Spectrum Club will be meeting virtually on Tuesday today at 2.30. Spectrum is a safe space for LGBTQIA plus students and allies to socialize and create change in the school community. If you are a member of Spectrum, you should have received a meet invite in your email. If not, email Miss Harry and she can send you a link. If you are interested in joining Spectrum, you can email Miss Harry or find her in room S102. Students who are on a day schedule can stay after in room S102 to attend the virtual meeting. It's time to check in on sports activities and with that, here's somebody. The football season continues this week on the road to Egan. I hear they got that outlet mall there. The guys are looking for win number one and they might get that on the field and in bargains at that outlet mall. The volleyball team is off to a one-on-one -on -one start and hoping for more when they get back on the court tomorrow night. Stay tuned to TV7 for more updates. 
Juniors Joseph Morphew and Gavin Hughes advanced to the Super Congress stage at last week's debate tournament in Lakeville, with Joseph taking eighth place. Not sure what that means, but it sounds awesome. Both soccer teams have playoff matchups with Duluth East tomorrow night. Good luck to both squads. And finally, Anderson's fantasy football team put a beating on mine this weekend, providing, proving his superior football mind, he is telling me, I must say. Um, that's your look at sports and activities. I'm Mr. Rickert. Hey, thanks from random staff member. Well, that's the news. Join us again next week where Andrew and Evan will continue to read the news in pleasing baritone. Till then, I'm Carly. We thank you for watching. Have a great day, Anoka. I am still living with your ghost, lonely and dreaming of the west.